It's so wonderful to have Sam Mendes back. Um, we played his very first film in 1999, The Incredible American Beauty, and we've followed his career, always just out of step with the timing of the release, but we've really, really loved watching his films and cheered him on in 2020 when he won the BAFTA Best Film for the incredibly um, expansive, hugely ambitious 1917. Um, and it's great to see him returning to the UK here for a much more intimate and personal story. Um, this is really different, but it's that same filmmaking of incredible quality with great characters and a beautiful script, working with the finest craftsmen in, in cinema. And this is a film that's very close to our hearts in terms of its theme. It's about art, it's about community. It's also about the power, not just of film to help us make meaning of our lives, but also the cinema as a space. Um, and that feels really important as uh, the exhibition sector is really struggling to find its feet after COVID. Um, and I know tonight you seeing the film here together is, a, is, a very, is gonna be a very beautiful experience um, for, for everyone. But without further ado, I would like to introduce Sam Mendes to introduce his beautiful film and his collaborators. Please welcome writer-director Sam Mendes. Hi everyone. Um, thank you, Tricia. It is indeed lovely to be back after 20 years, um, and it's particularly lovely and moving to be back with this movie, which is profoundly British. It feels like coming home, um, and I couldn't be more thrilled to be at what is, I probably shouldn't need to remind you, the highlight of the London film year and one of the greatest film festivals in the world. <laughs> there are a few people I want to introduce up on stage. Um, the movie you're about to see is very autobiographical. No, it doesn't feature me as a character, but it is nevertheless very personal. It's um, inspired by childhood memories I have of growing up around someone who was disintegrating mentally, um, and my teenage years where my racial opinions were formed in the early 1980s. It's not, as you might have heard or been told, just about the magic of movies. It's about mental illness and race and outliers, and how if you are broken, movies and music and art can help put you back together again. Um, and there are two other people I want to say thank you to. I want to say thank you to my wife, Ali. Um, there's too much for me to say in one sentence, but I can just say that she has been my muse since I met her, and this may be the only chance I get to say thank you. So thank you to Ali. <laughs> And, and lastly, I want to say thank you to my mum, who grew up struggling with and fighting with, heroically, mental illness while trying to bring up, all on her own, uh, annoying, noisy little boy. Um, I want to say thank you to her. Thank you to all of you for being here. It's a, very, um, it's a movie I'm very proud of, and I really hope you love it. Thank you. Thank you. 